if I could figure out where to sit, that would really be the shit. It's not cold, but just just need a little shawl, you know, security blanket type shit. back to my channel. If you haven't been here before, you can click that little subscribe button down below as well as the notification bell so that you always can see when I've uploaded something new. This is the fluffiest thing I've ever knit. I knit it. It's a big pink mohair silk kimono. So extra. I'm trying some different lighting again. I, I think that I enjoy this lighting a lot more. Anyway, moving forward, today I'm going to talk to you about Project Pan 2018, in my case, Summer 2018. <clears throat> and I'm just going to start out with just a few staples and work my way through to my hair products that I'm trying to just work my way through so that I can either repurchase or move on to the next superior, possibly superior or inferior product. Um, first up on Project Pan is one of everybody's old standby buddies, this Laura Mercier. It's called The Universal. I think I got the wrong one. I'm, I don't think I... everybody... there's like two and this might be the wrong one. You guys can tell me. Is this the one that like is not great or I don't know. Anyway, I need to use it up. I've got that much left and I've had this for longer than I'm going to admit. Anyway, I love this powder. I just, I, you know, I get lazy sometimes and I don't even finish my makeup, nonetheless start it. Um, so the Laura Mercier translucent powder, something I'm trying to pan. Um, I also have, mm, I'm going to say I've got maybe a quarter of this Hyaluronic, uh, there you go, Hourglass Illusion Hyaluronic Skin Tint with SPF 15. It's in shade Vanilla. And then I'm going to talk about the primers that I am trying to pan. Okay, so got the Lancome, this little sample size I've had <laughs> that made me buy this. And then the cover effects, cover effects, blurring primer. Got that in boxy charm, and I want to work through those before I go on to others. I have Tatcha Silk canvas waiting, calling my name. Just mm, so much to look forward to. Okay, <clears throat> I think that covers like face face makeup. I've got a tiny splash left of Lancome Be Facil Double Action Eye Makeup Remover. And with looks like this, honey, you need it. Especially with that waterproof mas mascara. Don't even play. Um, this is Lancome Sills Booster XL. It is really, really good. I never bought a full size of it because I am cheap and I keep running into free samples, but it is great for priming for your mascara. It keeps it from like getting flaky or dry or wanting you to like pick at it and pull out your lashes and stuff. That's not fun. And I have both the Extreme Grandio Grandiose Extreme and Grandiose Extreme Waterproof. I need to work through those. I'm sure with the summer and all the crying that I do, I could probably um, work through the waterproof one pretty quickly. And then we have two dose of colors, um, different types of lip colors here. One is like, you know, your bullet lipstick. Nice. I'll swatch that for you. It's called Koi. And I love it. I love it a lot. I was going to wear it with this look, but it doesn't go. And then you've got petals. which is more like a lip gloss and it's very light. I put a little bit under another lip product that I'm wearing today 
which is <clears throat> this, which I've had for longer than I care to admit as well, but it is still going. Look at this, like it's so pretty. That like I wiped this off so that it would be nice and blotted looking. It's a really nice, fresh looking summer look. Like you just ate a billion popsicles. It's so so sweet. Um, and then I have a bunch of little obsessive compulsive cosmetics, uh, little mini lip glosses and stained glosses and. Um, I think I also have another one. Yeah, I have these two. So I've got about five mini lip colors to work through. Curious how those will work out with some of the other looks I'm trying to do. And then I just have like Too Faced. I have a, a bunch of these, so I need to work through this. Too Faced better than, than Sex Mascara. And then I have an extra one of these. The Jordana Easy Liner in Mint. I have an extra one, so I'm just going to try and work through this. Next on my two pan list is going to be this great cleanser, Creme Radiance by Lancome. Yes. I use, I've been using this for years. I used to get these as samples in their, their little like gift with purchase sets, and I fell in love with it over the years. It, it does does keep my skin balanced and I've been trying to go back and forth to find new, better things that will make me happier, but sometimes the old things that you've, you've loved forever, you just keep, you keep loving them because they work. Um, two hairstyling products, first is the Moroccan Oil Dry Shampoo for, <clears throat> for light tones, so I'm thinking about going back completely bleached blonde. I'm not sure where I'll end up or land on that. Comment down below. What should I do with my hair? Links. Stylists, please, if you're in Seattle, please reach out to me. I really, really need a good hairstylist, please. And then we have the OGX coconut oil. It's just like a nice, like almost like a hair serum, I would call it very affordably priced and I want to work through this because I want to move on to something else. Um, then last but not least, not sponsored, I love Red Ken All Soft. These are, as far as salon, um, salon level products go, Red Ken is extremely reasonable. These are on Amazon. They're about 25 bucks each. They're about two to three times the size of a like a regular grocery store shampoo and if you do the math and you're willing to pay a little bit of a premium, you know, but not much, you can pick up Redken instead of Suave or, you know, whatever. Um, Yo, I think I made it through everything. I don't have that much to pan. There's tons of stuff that I have in my collection, but I don't think there's any chance I'll pan everything. But I'm going to work on this stuff, and we'll do an update and see how I'm doing at the end of summer. Hope you've enjoyed this project pan update or announcement. <laughs> I'm really excited to take part in it, and I will try to figure out and credit who whose idea this was and link them down below in the description box. As always, I am not um, sponsored. All of these opinions are my own, yada, yada, yada. I'll see you in the next one.